Today we're tying the twisted gaddis. We're going to begin by putting a bead on the hook, curved shank hook, scud hook, if you will, and we'll wrap our thread onto the shank and bring it back up. We want that thread to stop pretty much even with the bend of the hook. Those curved hooks are kind of difficult to know exactly where to stop sometimes. We're going to use polar flash chenille. Uh, you can use any kind of strands you want to make a, a variety of shapes or colors to it. This particular one is just olive. Olive and tan are the two favorite ones that we use in the shop. We'll secure that down to the shank of the hook. And all the way back to where our thread was at. And then it helps to have rotating hackle pliers. Um, and then you'll just twist this into a rope, nice and tight. And then wrap this forward. And it makes a really pretty segmentated body with a lot of flash. Caddis are pretty bright when they're coming up. Gas bubble builds into their exoskeleton before they make that final emergence. Helps glisten. Bring that forward, wrap it off. Wing buds, we're just going to use goose by it. One on one side. I want that to go down most of the body, kind of that curvature facing away. And then one on the other side. Excess. This probably isn't all that important. Let me put it on anyway. And then I'm going to use a little CDC. This is important. Caddis are extremely good swimmers and a lot of motion when they're coming up to emerge. And so that cat, that CDC will give that illusion of movement. As it breathes through the current, we're going to go ahead and tie that into the tips. And then you really don't need much more than a couple of wraps. It depends on how, s how dense a CDC feather you've got. And we don't want the really clean tips. We want kind of the, kind of the dirty ones. And it looks like a mess right here, but once you get that on, you can pull everything back and then wrap it down. And it just creates a nice little soft hackle. A lot of movement in the waters. Moves through. And then black dubbing. Uh, be hairs, natural hair's ear, a, 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 an antron blend, even just, um, I think this is, this is the uh, ice dub. Good contrast to it. And then just a little whip finish. Gaddis.